All right. Cool. Let's do this. I've played this before it was released for a bit. Then I kind of forgot about it. So, here I am playing it again. Hopefully I can actually beat it without killing everybody and starting over. Which would suck. Playing on second to most difficult setting, because I don't want to just die. Tentacles. <clears throat> Yeah, that's one way to stop it, I suppose. I am playing with a controller and headphones, so I've got, like, everything I need right here. <coughs> September 25th, 1998. Super close to the Raccoon City incident, people. Oh, there are it's two different universes. Daniel's apartment. Oh. Home sweet home. Mm, sounds right. Mm. That's fair. Nice. Western and cop movies, huh? X Files. That's cool. Ah, uh, why not? Why? Cool bike. <coughs> no, you did not. The trash is not taken out. Kill you. Come on. Wait, I'm sorry, what? What's your drug of choice on a Friday evening, my friend? <coughs> Pardon me. Well, you should probably go shopping. Definitely reminds me of like Resident Evil ish style camera angles and stuff, which is kind of cool. Oh, oh that's fun. Seriously. Let's just walk out of the room now. Historical fiction author who sold four million copies of his last novel. It's impressive. All right, let's answer this bitch. Hello, Daniel. It's me again. Hey, we've got a bit of a major emergency going on here. Oh, you're joking. Friday evening, and there's an emergency. This is serious business. Sebastian Husher is nowhere to be found, and his manuscript should have been at the office by Tuesday. He won't answer his calls, and he hasn't shown up at his office at the university. He's vanished into thin air. Oh, don't screw with me, Etienne. Call him on Monday, or send a courier for him. I, I just got in the door less than five minutes ago. I go myself, but I've got to attend Albert's performance in half an hour. Plus, Husher's house is closer to your place than it is to mine. Come on, man. The sooner you go, the sooner you'll get back home. You're going to owe me a big fat favor. Whatever you want. Write this down. 4 Abbott Thomas Road. In the old housing developments along Highway EB-15. EB-15? Good God, that's out in the sticks. I plan to take a few days off after this. Well, we'll talk about that once you find him. Oh, and if he gives you the manuscript, don't show it to anyone. And don't go selling it off to the highest bidder. I'll see what I can do. We'll ring you up when I get back. 
Thanks, Dan. You're saving my skin. Again. Another Friday evening and I'm working as an errand boy. I suppose they're too important over at Wake Publishers to come looking for jolly old Husher themselves. Shit. Even I should be too important for that. I mustn't overstretch my complaints. Rising from my lot as a drunkard and financial ruin to that of an errand boy is actually quite an improvement. If only things had gone a bit better for the company, or I'd got on the wagon a bit sooner. Damn, Sophie did the right thing when she divorced me. I would have divorced myself in her place. Daniel Neuer, the bloody alcoholic. Chin up, you. That is Daniel Neuer, the bloody ex-alcoholic, after all. Wake Publishers employee by day, Wake Publishers screwed over lackey by evening. Even Friday evenings. But if I could find Husha, I have a feeling my status at the company would rise quite a bit. After all, he is the publishing firm's biggest star. Let's cross our fingers and hope he's home. I rather like those kind of cutscenes. They're really cool and art artsy. <clears throat> well, to the house I go. Not a bad looking house, but does look a little abandoned me. Kind of like the front yard, though. It's pretty sweet. Yeah, that's pretty off-putting. Apparently he does. Yeah. What's this? Oh, that's fun. Murderers. Hello. And the door is open. <clears throat> is Great that sign. Music? I'd better take a look. Light source. Turn it off and on. Yep. All right. Well, if someone's light source is a candle or a lighter, it should run out. I mean... Is that someone playing a music box? Do people play music boxes? I thought they played themselves. Yeah, walking into someone's house is not really a very good picture if the authorities show up. <clears throat> Mark's 12. Guess it needs fixing. I mean, it is relatively working. Alright. <laughs> Apparently, I need to go looking for the music, so I guess I should do that. left side. Not from that. I'll see. Documents and items. Okay. Oof. <clears throat> Dear Sebastian, how are you? 
To be completely honest, I must admit that we are all impatiently waiting your latest work. My dear friend, I must ask a favor of you. Enclosed with this letter, you will find one of the latest items we have purchased at the store. An ornate music box with fascinating engravings. The craftsmanship is astonishing, but something else has caught my eye. Or perhaps I should say, my ear. The melody, Sebastian. It's peculiar. You have to listen to it yourself. I've never heard the song before, and all my attempts at finding the score, or the name of the composer, have failed. I cannot for the life of me get that melody out of my head. Ooh, is there a bag? Nope. Would you be willing to help me find any clues regarding this box and... Oh god, I can't read that. Melody, question mark, would be forever grateful. <clears throat> A little, yeah. Let's see what we got. What the? Yeah, it's not ominous. Can there be a door there? Oh, that's a good question, because the other side of that is a wall. Screwdriver? 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 Nope. Just stuff. Um, I'd assume the rifles are real. Is the door open? Oh god, it's open! Well, that guy's fucked. I'd hardly taken a step forward when I heard the door close behind me. When I turned around, the door wasn't there anymore. And all that was left of it was a strange shadow on the wall. I searched. I despaired. And I screamed until my throat began to burn. The candles started to run out, as did the batteries in my torch. From within the most suffocating darkness, the hours went by until turning into days. And I began to fall in and out of a restless sleep. I would hear voices, sometimes right next to me, other times a few yards away. It seemed like they were coming from the other side of the wall. Desperate cries, howling in horror, and sometimes, the worst of all, a vast, oppressive silence would fall, seeming to emanate from everywhere and nowhere all at once. There was nobody there, just hallucinations, nightmares, black nothingness, and the song from that music box. Trapped in this impossible place, I wondered was going to die there. Well, that's depressing. <clears throat> Etienne, do you have any news on Daniel yet? Oh, Sophie. No. We've been calling him at home all day, but there's no response. Do you know if he's got a mobile phone? No, I don't think so. And if he does, he doesn't tend to keep it on him. Oh, man. I think I should pass by the Husher place when I leave, just to see if they know anything. Husher the writer? Your client? Yeah. I sent Daniel over there on Friday, and I haven't heard from him since. What's the address? I'm going to stop by Daniel's place, and if I don't find him, I can go around and ask about him. The house on the outskirts of town, on Highway EB-15. Number four, Abbott Thomas Road. It's a big house. Okay. I'm headed over. Call me if you find him. Uh, of course. Same to you. My apologies. I was just uh, going to use the bathroom. I didn't realize how long that would actually 
last. Uh, let's see. Who are we going to go as? Well, let's see here. Um, scented can. Candles. I'm gonna go her because they're the family marriage and I feel like she'd probably go first. I mean she was looking for him, so most appropriate character to choose first and hopefully not end up killing. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. I wish it was daytime. scented candles. I have three of them, so let's use this wisely. Door's still unlocked. The door was open. Is there anybody home? I would say no, and also, uh, I don't know if a moat would really do that. Let's see here. My dear eccentric husband, I left your key in the top drawer of your bureau in the library. The children have been very nervous lately. We need to talk about this as soon as you get back, and I don't want them playing with it. I'm assuming they're talking about the box. Upstairs library. Okay. Oh, okay. She's talking about the picture there. Uh, let's, uh, see what we're going here for. Probably an old rotary phone, I would assume. <clears throat> this looks like a library. Well, let's see. Um, definitely seems like a library. Ah, the typewriter. Damn. Need lubricant. Okay. Huh. How about taking the Japanese sword? You want to take the books, but not the sword. Alright. I don't think I need anything in here. What does the key go to, is the question. I'm not entirely sure. I uh, probably could get it to light if I had some wood, because you can't light soot. Actually, that's not true. I think you can get that to cause a fire, but it wouldn't have any fuel. Wish I could walk faster, lady. I would want to be in and out of this house as quick as possible, my dude. Like, nah. <laughs> that must be where that key goes. That's an odd thing to think about. Alright. Oh, 
Whoa, 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 what is that? Hold on. There's something on the counter. I yes, that that's fair. There's also something on this counter. Give me those matches, thank you. Huh. Righteous. Alright, we got matches. That's what you can use to light the fire. If they're bringing the rot, then they've, they've been not been here for a while because apples, apples take a while to rot. <laughs> huh. Metal ring, more like something broke off of the ring. Oof. That's not. <laughs> that's not good. Serve cereal, wide range, perishable foods. It's not what I'm looking for. What is this? Uh, oil can. Wait, I'm sorry, can I use that? Uh -huh. Noise! <coughs> Said I need the lubricant. Hello. Okay. What was that? That was uh, something not wanting to. Um... I don't hear anything. Um, from now on, you can listen to what's happening on this side of the ring and examine doors. Sometimes you might have the chance to do it with other doors as well. Pay attention when you're near one. Yeah. I didn't hear anything in there. <sighs> That's... Super freaking creepy. Did I just take that? Okay. Let's go back to the... Uh... Okay, I can't listen to anything, so that means I should be good. Hopefully. I need a key for that room. Hopefully the key I'm about to get goes to that room. Alright. Come on. Still don't see any listening things, so... Hopefully we don't have to deal with that. Love the ambience and the music. I believe that. Yep, sweet. Alright. Jam the door. Huh. Sweet. Alright, so I got a key for a couple of doors. Oh God, why? Your phone. Yeah, I should answer it. Hello? Sorry, who is this? I can't understand you. We can't leave my room. What the? And that is my cue to just leave and the house? just be like, nope. 
Sorry, dude. Not having it. Yeah, no, if I heard that shit, I'd be fucking out of here. It doesn't sound like my problem. Yes. Alright, cool. This door is now open. Surprise, surprise, the fucking door is not there. But a stain is. <coughs> Holy shit, what? I saw another door yesterday. As I was walking by the dining room, I suddenly heard music from Daddy's music box. When I went in, I saw the door. I went running to tell Mummy, but when I, we came back, it was gone. She scolded me for making things up. It's not fair. I was telling the truth. There's an old door here, different from the rest. I even had a key in the hole. If I see it again, I'll go inside and leave the door open. That way, Mommy will believe me. I saw the weird door. Julie said that one, that, uh, the one that wasn't there before. Well, hello. Mommy was very angry and kept yelling at Julia. Door is scary. I will go hide in the key in the dollhouse and I will hide the five dolls too, even if they get mad at me, and I will bring them out when Mommy and Julia forget about the door. One will be hungry, so her friend will make dinner for her. One, another one will read while her mom takes a shower. The ugly on one will watch the door so nobody comes in. Okay, so I've got to find five dolls. Awesome. I have a feeling I'm going to need that. Oof. Well, that's not very helpful. Oh, God. Run, run. Yes. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I got, I got that. I got that. Shut the door. Holy shit. No. Yeah. Just remember to be extra careful. Yeah. No shit. Oh God. Yeah, I'm not remotely happened? going to that door. What was pushing that door? Uh, a lot of fucking hands and a lot of scary shit, and I'm not having it. Not my house. This ain't my house. But you get what I mean. That's just not no. Fuck. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to put a little thing here, which should keep this area nice and secure, so I don't have to deal with that shenanigans. Um, I do have to go... <coughs> That's the door that led to this area, so that was weird. Whatever. Whatever works. I think... The key fits in this lock. Noise. Alright. I don't think there's anything back here. I mean, there's things back here, but... Come on. Would you let me... Okay. Um, those birds are dead. Cool. All right, I'm going to need that firewood. I think I need 
lighter fluid too. Uh oh. Please don't. My controller is vibrating and it is not filling me with the most confidence right now. But I don't see the listening, so I think I'm good. <clears throat> You'd think seeing stuff like that would make you walk a little faster. But I guess not. Alright, let's go do a uh, fireplace thing. First, I'm gonna have to put some firewood in there. There we go. Next, we're gonna use some matches. Are you. What? Really? Come on, man. <clears throat> I don't know, there's plenty of flammable things in this room. So just, you know, throw it on the fire. It's not your house. And obviously, the residents are gone. Hmm. Well, fuck. I do definitely appreciate, like, the whole, like, Resident Evil vibe with the camera angles and stuff. It's kind of neat. I am missing... Yeah, come outside, not in here. Uh oh. Please don't. Catherine, do not look at this photo. Ha! Uh ha! -huh. Uh -huh. Fuck. Well, that's not good. Okay. Fuck. Well, that answers that question. Ah, oh, come on. Dude, no, don't do this to me. Quickly. That room looks really dark. Yeah, cuz yeah, it is dark. That, no, not happening. Yep, cool. Bye. Not doing that. That screams death. <laughs> Page turner, blah, 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 blah. What you got? Uh, we got a bathroom. Yes. Dishcloth. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why you gotta do that to me? Oh, that was a waste of time. <laughs> Probably shouldn't touch that. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. We got a doorway here. Okay. It's a big fucking house. Uh, what am I looking at here?
trap door. Trap door. I'm so confused. Like, what do I have that would... I have nothing. Yeah, I know. I have no idea how that would, um, pertain to me. This way we go. What's that? Um, garage door opener? Yes. I, I would mind. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Ah. Pretty sure that's what this goes to. But. Okay. I mean, I'm digging the books and stuff. That's kind of cool. Okay. Spot to hide. Nice. All right. Okay. I don't need to grill anything, but having some tongs might be useful. So much for happy anniversary. <laughs> kind of looks like you never kind of did it. Let's see here. Mm -mm. No matter how much I want that floodlight, yep. Fertilizer. So I'm going to need something to connect that floodlight to that. Yeah, it does. Okay. So if I was a floodlight, what would I... I think I know. <coughs> All right. So we're going to go to the last section and see what's up there. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Dear Sebastian, I wanted to tell you firsthand that I will be taking some much needed time off, which means that the store will be closed as of tomorrow. I wanted you to hear it from me, rather than read it on a sign on our door. My daughter is currently traveling and I must confess I can't keep up with our everyday demands on my own especially since I haven't been able to sleep well lately. As soon as she's back, we'll be open for business again. Rest assured, you will be the first to know. I hope you to feel better by then. Please give my warmest regards to your family. Sincerely, Isaac Farber. I don't know why I put my head against leaning against that. <laughs> I guess I just scaffold goes here. Far Okay. This is a very nice house. Alright. Uh-uh. Oh god. Is there someone on the other side? Uh... Probably not a good idea to open that door. Plus it's locked anyways. So. Thank you game for not killing me. Uh... Shit.
Oh, I think I... No. No. Never mind. I lost it. Nope. Alright, so. Back downstairs. Let's go to the kitchen. There's water with a wire in it. But I have a washcloth. So I think I can soak up the water. I thoroughly enjoy games that have a bunch of puzzles and Resident Evil-ish kind of feel. I believe this is the kitchen. Where did this door? Oh, it was like right next door. I don't know why I did that. Alright, well. Uh, bam. <laughs> bye bye, puddle. Okay, so that solves that problem. But it doesn't solve my power problem. Um, shit. So I've got. Matches, a garage door opener, tongs, and a screwdriver. And two more candles that I can make places safe. So I should do like the broadest places I'm going to have to go through. This place is safe because I feel like I'm going to have to go back and forth between all these doors. I think. This is the... Oh, shit. Oh, thank Christ. <laughs> I should have listened before I opened that door. Excuse me, Please stop. Um, let's go ahead and ease up the ambience a little bit. Okay. I don't hear anything. Let's go into the uh, garage here. Uh, it's a old school bike. Let's see here what we got. We got a old rusty metal box full of fuses. Okay. Yes. It's screwed down, huh? Okay. I don't think I had a flathead. Is that a flathead? Mm -mm. Uh, aha! Combine. Mm. Noise. Got the fuses. Let's see here. Uh, boiler functioning upper panel. Shut down. Press the left button. Start. Press the central button. Emptying. Press the right button. In case of malfunctioning, press venting correct boiler functioning. You can perform emergency shutdown by keeping the blue button pressed for four seconds. Uh, no electricity though. Uh, yeah, you know, holy f fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> that was not cool. <laughs> yeah, I'm uh, ready to get the fuck out of that room. <laughs> then we got left and right. I think this is the basement. Seems quiet. Let's try that door. Mm -mm. Well, that was the last door for that key. Oof. Like the worst place in the house. Dude, come on. Why you gotta be like that? I don't like basements even in real life. There's a note stuck on the sink. 
1945. I doubt it's original. There is a note on the safe. Let's see here. Dear Julia, if you found this note, congratulations. You're one step closer to solving the puzzle I've prepared for you. I hope it keeps you entertained while I'm away. I've hidden your favorite doll in the safe and changed the combination. Since you aspire to becoming a detective when you grow up, I think this is a great chance to put your deduction skills to the test. The new combination is as follows. The number of our street address, Saul's age, the decade and year the canvas hanging upstairs right to the staircase was painted. Good luck, my dear inspector. Hugs and kisses from daddy. Fuck. What's the address to this place? Four? And Hold on. Documents. Drawing by Saul. Saul is seven. Okay. Uh, um, I think it's four, seven, what the fuck? Well, let's just, uh, let's get the electricity back on first, shall we? That sounds like a right good time. Fuses are misshapen. Oh, hello. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> it didn't, there's like... Yeah, I know I put him in wrong, you dick. I have no idea. Uh, oh, okay, freaking wires connected to the blah blah. Okay, so I have to match the amperage to the wires inside the box on the left. That's not super easy. Okay, so 30 amp. Let's get 30 amp first. Uh, that would be... yellow and green uh, but I don't have anything in here that equals 30 oh wait yes I do I'm an idiot okay so that I believe handles that 50 amp is this wire here I think so hold on I might be wrong on one of these 50 amp going with the angle there will be that. So 50 would be. 50 is going to have to be 3 connected to it. So. The first box right there is probably the 50. Blue, green, and yellow. So if I was going to equal 50. Can't be that. And twenty five needs to be twenty five. I believe it's that one. I believe thirty. This middle goes to the middle one. Wait, hold on. Bam, 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 bam. That can't be 25. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> All right. 
I'm, I'm close. I, I know that's right. It's just hard to, like, guess where these yellow stripe wires go. That's kind of what I need to do. Okay, I know I'm correct on how they add up. So there's 25 to the right here. He's got to go to this blue and one here. So that right there, that's not 25, that's 35. Um, that's 25. Okay, so then yellow and green with that box could very well go to that 50, could not go to that 50. The mo neither of those could, that wouldn't make sense. All right, hold on. <coughs> Two go to there, green and blue. So if I wanted to get 30 to the first box, <sighs> let's see here. Restart real quick. <clears throat> All right, 25. What's going to equal 50? 3 is going to equal 50. 25, 35, 40, 50. So 25, 15, and 10 are going to equal 50. So I need to find the box that goes to three different junctions, which would be the first one. So, and then I just have to figure out from there between the other two. So... No, no, no. Okay, that right there is correct. Um, that equals 50. No, it doesn't. I'm an idiot. That equals 50. <laughs> now I just need to look at the other ones to calculate those. 25 plus 25 makes no sense. So... Hell yeah! Deduction reasoning! That's what I thought. Finally. Daniel, if you're here, I'm going to find you. I'm sure you will, lady. Hopefully, before I run into something super fucking terrifying. Oh shit. Please don't. Thank you. I don't have time for this shit. Junk. Junk. I need to find that oval painting. I swear to God, it's down here somewhere. Or did I imagine that? Well, nonetheless, I need to go back to that safe eventually. I've got the... Well, I don't have to listen, so... I think this room is safe, as long as I have candles in it, so I really don't have to worry about that. Sweet. Alright. Fuck me. Lock from the other side. I do have to go down there, but I can turn on several things, uh, one of which, ah, yes, right, I have to, uh,
Well, I turned that off. Useful. Righteous. Alright. Let's, uh... <laughs> I'm gonna need those. <clears throat> Thank you very much. Hello? Uh... You say try and take the folder. Is it gonna kill me if I do that? Because I don't... I want the folder. But I don't want to fucking die. <laughs> So, you're putting me in a precarious predicament, you little shit. Oh, I heard a dog out here, I swear. Oh, I don't see... Yeah, that doesn't seem to be doing anything. Let's see. We've got nothing that I think fucking matters out here. Do I need a shovel? No. Well. I don't hear anything weird. Mm -mm. Well, I don't have a key for that door, so that's kind of useless. I'll come back to that. Should I go back downstairs? I'm thinking I should look in the basement a little more thoroughly. No, there's nothing in there that's apparently going to spook me, so. It's kind of impressive that you have a candle that never fucking goes away, so. Yeah. Did they switch? No, there's definitely an over. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> Fuck you. Seriously. Not cool, man. I don't see any other paintings, though. Where the fuck is that oval painting? Not over here, is it? I don't know, as far as I'm aware. Okay, so I guess we have to go back upstairs. I'll have to come back down here for whatever's in that safe. Because I don't know the combination. I think we're on the four. Number four is the house number. Number seven is the age, but then it said something about. Something about decade and year. So, yeah. And that painting is missing. Shouldn't have to listen in here either because I put a candle in the middle of here. Specifically for the reason of it's not in the bottom, is it? Did I miss it? No. It's not the 45. See, because it's missing, and it's an oval shape. So, I'm gonna go... Oh god, please, no. I don't think this was open. Oh, there's a wardrobe. Get in. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm working on a lady. <laughs> Holy fuck, no. Uh, 
what am I doing? What am I doing? Uh, LTRT. Holy shit, please stop. <laughs> two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. I'm doing it. Why are you not? Come on. Stop it. Slow down. Calm down. Oh my god. Lady, I swear to god. It's it's your imagination, please. Am I going to be stuck in this loop? Is this a bug? I think I found a bug. Because I'm stuck. Come on. pause I can't do anything if I stop this she's gonna die Dude, come on. This is getting old. How do I fucking... Dude, what the fuck? What am I doing wrong? I'm doing what it told me to do. Holy shit, dude, come on. It, why am I stuck in this loop? Dude, I've been fucking stuck in this for like fucking minutes. Holy fuck. Why did that take so long? Holy shit. It took like a solid minute. Was that for real? Or am I imagining things? No, you're not imagining things, but holy fuck, dude. This whole seven something something, what else now? Yeah, fuck off. Tall house is marvelous. If I found dolls, this is where I'd put them. I haven't found a single fucking one.
Oh, that door's fucking gone. Anyways. I'm putting a candle here so that shit doesn't happen again. Fuck you. And your shenanigans. That was fucking annoying. Yeesh. God damn, man. Right, let's go ahead. Saddle up. Yes, it can. It can be turned. Focus! Oops. Ching a ching a ching. Alright, I think that's all I need from here. Several other things I need. I do not have access to right now, unfortunately. Sorry about that. Water. <coughs> Necessary. All right, well, seems fine. Oh, hello, what on earth are you? Um, <laughs> there we go. Uh, Masha, I don't know what the fuck that is. We have Julia right here. Okay. That seems relatively harmless. Okay, yeah, uh huh. Mommy's really scared. That's fucking terrifying. Uh -huh. I am... <clears throat> Hello? Huh. Nice. Uh... Yeah, that's awesome. seem to hear anything coming from the room. Must be careful. Must be careful. That's what those are for. <coughs> That's nasty, dude. Ugh, it's twitching. Very unpleasant. Very unpleasant. Yep, yep, yep. Please, please do not get spooked. And they're all gone now. Awesome. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. And walk the fuck away. Should be fine to open this door though, because of the candle. So 
style. Cool. Let's just uh, keep the candle here because it helps calm the person down. Do, do, do. I'm just walking casually through someone's house. You know how one does. Ah, okay, so there's fucking. There's paintings all over the place, so I. I'm supposed to find the fucking oval painting where the hell they moved it to. Uh, let's see. We're going to combine this with this. And we're going to use this on this. Smashing. Look, Marianne. I'm a sloth. Sorry, that's stuck in my head now. Dear Sebastian, everything is falling apart. I don't know what is happening to my phone, I keep, but I can't seem to reach you, which is why I am writing this. As I do, I pray that it is not too late. Sebastian, do not listen to the music box. I repeat, do not listen to that music box. Something is wrong with the melody. I hear it over and over in my head while I walk and when I read, while I eat or sleep, even in my dreams. And these are getting worse and worse. I feel observed, Sebastian. At first it only happened in my dreams, but lately I also feel it while I'm awake, although I find it increasingly hard to tell the difference these days. There's something here with me, a strange presence in the halls behind the door I turn my back to. I don't know what's happening to me. I'm so sorry, my dear friend. I curse the day I sent you that box. Shit. Useful. Still need to find that stupid fucking painting. Maybe they put it on the wall somewhere. I said so cold. Uh. Oh, it's cold. I don't understand a thing. We understand that. It finally stopped. I thought I had to run away. That was uh, certainly fucking freaky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, this one's supposed to watch the door, but I don't remember which fucking room that door is in. I don't think that's right. But we'll just leave it there for now. Ah! Jesus fuck! I've got a block in. Come on. Lady, you got this. Holy shit. <laughs> Not cool, dude. <laughs> My God. I'm supposed to go out through that door. How the fuck am I supposed to do that? It's the only door to leave. Thanks, so if I open that door, I'm fucked. And I'm stuck in this room. Well, I... Hopefully I can find solace and... I don't know. Is there a... Oh, here we go. That's why. Okay. We just have to sit here for a second. Restart, because I don't know what the hell that does. Okay, it's gone. Little bastard. Alright, so there's a painting somewhere. Also, there's a way to get into the attic somewhere ah there we go thank Done. you although i'm not sure if i should be relieved to be honest uh i wouldn't be there's the painting i'm looking for 
98. Okay, 4798. I believe that. Uh, hello? I'm not doing that. What the fuck is doing that? What the fuck? <laughs> Dude, is that the game? Because that's not cool. Okay. <laughs> Where I need to go is over here. Ha 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 ha. Holy shit. Um, are you okay, little girl? Are you gonna murder me? Hey, Julia? Uh-huh. Are you okay? Oh my fucking god, you're not. Uh. Oh. What is this? A crying gift, a pardon gift, but only if they're themselves. What the f Fuck. Oh, sh Jesus. What? what? Where did you go? Fuck, kid. Oh. Yeah. Yes, I should go. It's fine. There's fucking there's a thing right there. It's a good thing I'm not wearing high heels. It's also a fucking good thing I chose the right goddamn one to do. Oh, shit. Cool telescope, bro. Uh, I think I can get into the... Hello? Okay. Anybody there? There's no one here, dude. Just me, myself, and I. Whoa. We can't leave the house. Oh. I don't get it. I just, I just don't get any of this. Uh, I do. They're fucking trapped, dude. It's really not that hard to get. Yeah, I can hide behind, underneath that. That's good to know. Uh. Oh, well, got another doll. Okay. Uh oh. Well, I'm glad that there's nothing wrong with this one. Sebastian, I received the box again. I can't even stand to look at it, but still, I hear its music. After returning it to me, has anything changed? Do you feel better? If so, maybe I should do the same, don't you think? I should try to find the previous owner if that's possible. Have you discovered anything? Please, do tell me. I can't sleep or stay awake. I feel a presence. There's something here with me. Fuck. Dude, that's not good, dudes. You guys fucked. There's nothing in this room besides that letter, though. I was a door. Yes. That bird just fucking killed itself. Huh? Poor bird. Probably died instantly. I mean, yeah. You're not wrong, kid. Please stop with the spooks. Now I know how to handle that other one. I'm pretty sure this is the doorway that leads to that fucking... Well, I was wrong. Wrong doorway. This is the door. Fuck. Wrong door. <laughs> There's too many fucking doors. God damn it. This is... The door question mark? It's the only fucking door down here, so I'd assume. Okay. 
Yeah, we got that. Uh... Ding. Burned all that darkness away. Nice. I believe... I have a key. I don't know what the key goes to. Classical music box. Alright. Mm -hmm. Let's play this. Oops, I didn't think that would stop it. Oh well. Uh -huh. Okay. So, I've got three dolls. I think there's five dolls. There's five dolls. I have three dolls. Um, egg, salmon. A crying gift. A parting gift. But only... If they're themselves. Can I not open the thing? Like, what am I supposed to do with this? Alright, I'm out of fucking scented candles, too. Alright. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the basement and then we're gonna go through the garage outside to uh, 4798. I think that is the key code to the safe downstairs, which I believe more than likely has a doll in it. So that's four, and then I'm just missing one doll. Yeah, there's a thing back here, so it should be fine. Ominous. Unless it's six digits. It says 1798 on that picture, so... I guess we'll just have to see. This is the thing that mentioned the note. Well, I was right. On both accounts. Two dolls. Four dolls. I need... I still need to light that fire in the fucking... Alright. For real, though. Like, there's some shenanigans going on. That other door is locked behind it, isn't it? Alright, I think this key goes to that door. I'm fairly certain. So let's just, uh... I hate how this character is just moseying. Like, if this was me, I'd be hauling ass, man. Like, pretty, pretty hauling ass. I'd be out of there, to be honest. Less first. Okay. We won't immediately die. So that's fun. Notes, chores, and odd jobs do. Some are written in Cyrillic alphabet. The fuck is that? Hello, hello. What do we have here? A note from Misha to her husband. Alexander, I wish you had never found this note. Oh, sorry, I wish you never had to find this note. I left the house, or at least I tried. I pray that this is not the last time you hear from me. I haven't seen Mrs. Catherine or the children in days. Sometimes I hear them crying upstairs, but I never find them. 
They always seem to be in the room next door, if such a room exists. There is something horrendous here with us. Something that I cannot describe. I barely dare to leave my room anymore. I have to go before it's too late. I love you. Masha. Okay. Oh, God! Fuck me! Jesus Christ! Fucking Christ. Come on. Holy. Just, just gotta control that heartbeat, man. Very slowly. Oh shit, oh shit. Come on, slow down. Come on, slow down. Slow down. Slow down, lady. Slow down. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Oh god. Oh shit. <laughs> Fuck me, I killed her. That thing is hard to fucking get, man. Now I gotta go find all the fucking dolls and everything. Oh my god. <sighs> How annoying. Fuck you. Fucking monsters, fuck you. <sighs> fuck me. I thought I had it. Damn it. I thought I had it. <sighs> what a huge pain in the dick. Yeah, we're going to skip that, because I don't... Oh, apparently not. Yeah, come on, mister. Yeah, I gotta go fucking pick up the character's stuff, because she didn't make it, because I apparently still don't know how to do that dumb minigame. It's my own fault. That's annoying. Okay. Uh. That's kind of annoying. Oh, I'm super glad that that just fucking decided to kill itself. Gotta go all the way back and grab Sophie's stuff. Well, I'm super sad she didn't make it, because I'm pretty sure I have to, like, go through all the chapters with whatever characters make it. Maybe? Maybe she comes back next chapter. I don't... That would make sense, though. Alright. Come on. Oh, there's all her crap. Hmm. Well, I was supposed to go to this room.
Come on. Don't be a wuss. I say as I would have already shat my pants. I'm the biggest wuss. Sleeping pills. Well, I mean, you need them, you need them, I suppose. I already killed Sophie. Sadness. Uh, no, what I'm looking for is. Huh. I believe that. Not looking to kill another character. I hope. Uh, unlock this and get the fuck mm -hmm. out of here. Far away from that other door, please. Very far away from that really creepy kid noise. What did I have to do? for the fire specifically. It, I don't remember. I know I have to do it, but I don't know why. Or if there was any specific reason other than just making this a more hospitable place. Upstairs. Try not to die. I really suck at that stupid minigame. Trying to keep the heartbeat in check. Am I supposed to, like, go with the flow, or am I supposed to one be the one to slow it down? I have no idea. Okay, what I need to do is get to the fucking kids' room. Door is that again? Was it this one? It was this one. Documents. Kid. Documents. Something. Uh -huh. Nope. Not that one. Not that one either. No, not that one. I don't remember. <laughs> There's a note for this, and I swear to God I had it. I think it's this one. Yes, it is. I will hide the dolls in the house. One will be hungry, so her friend will make dinner for her. Another will read while her mom takes a shower. The ugly one will watch the door so nobody comes in. Uh, it's not very descriptive, kid. Seen. I don't fucking know. I also don't know what the hell he's talking about. One will be hungry, so her friend will make dinner for her. Another one will read while her mom takes a shower. 
The ugly one will watch the door, so nobody comes in. Okay, so could you tell me which one? You're not very... Descriptive, kid. Okay, someone needs to take a shower. Alright, hold on. First, let's examine these dolls. Hmm. Focused on something in the distance. I'm assuming that one's reading. Ah. Mm -hmm. That one's shower. That's gotta be it. Okay, this one's taking a shower. This one's reading. So... Is this one here? Here? No. <sighs> Fucking hell. I've got the hang of which one, some of them. this again. Uh -huh. Hello. Don't be a dick. Come on. I was sad that I had to fucking kill one character. That's not good. Uh, nope. It's the problem with tank controls. <laughs> you know, little shit. Go the right way. You know which way you're going. Come on, buddy. You know that I've got to go this way. You and I both know. Oh shit, that means uh, that was gnarly fucking Christ. God damn, what is that? That is fucking metal, kid. Uh, Ada, save us. We are doomed. Yeah, okay. I'll do that, bud. I need to go in that room. I don't think there's another way into that room. As far as I'm aware, there isn't. I'm pretty sure I need to go in that room, because that's where the door was before. Yeah, it sounds like if I open that door, I'm going to die, but that's the room I need to go in, so what the hell am I supposed to do? Yeah, I understand this. Am I going to kill another character? 
That's a possibility. But I know this is the door I need to go into. So. Uh, yep. Killed the character. Etienne did not make it. Fuck. Dude, what the fuck? What do you want me to do? Like, that's the door I need to go into, you ass. You guys are a bunch of fucking douchebags. I better get the goddamn characters back in the next episode, because otherwise doing the last bit of episodes is going to be hell. I'm not afraid to combine objects, kid. I'm afraid that you're just going to freaking off me the suit, like, the second chance you get. Because I didn't do something. Okay, well, first of all, you little shits. Why is the door open? Uh, he's a Russian. Awesome. Uh, the door is open because I got someone fucking straight killed. I like how he doesn't give a fuck. It's straight up just not going to let me in that room. I swear to God, that's the room I need to go in. Maybe not. Am I missing something? I must be missing something. Aid us, save us, we are doomed, bound and slave to its desire. Am I supposed to find all these things? I guess I'm supposed to find that. Uh, I'm supposed to go to all the little places that they should be. Kitchen. Dining room. Uh... Not this place. Uh, upstairs. Uh, upstairs is where I need to go. The library. And taking a bath. Is there a library upstairs? Yeah, there is. And the bath, I would assume, is the master bedroom. Assuming that one is this way and the other one is the other way. Yep. Help us make it push, pull us through. Uh huh. We'll totally do that. I'm assuming the last one is through the bathroom of the master bedroom. I would hope. <coughs> so I killed that guy for no reason at all. Oops. Toss the dark one in the fire. No, I'm not helping you. 
not that I don't want to, it's just... Yeah, okay. It's not that I don't want to help you, it's just that I'm pretty sure if I do, you'll kill me. So, I'm not gonna do that. Alright, I think I know. So what I gotta do is I gotta grab that doll that I used in this room. Okay. I must grab the doll. Take that. Ugh, fuck me. Okay. It seems fine. I gotta go burn this bitch. Uh, you talk about haunted house. This is a, it's a fucking haunted house. Come on. Really wish the characters didn't walk slow as goddamn Roomba with low battery. Let's go. Fuck that thing. Burn in hell, demon. And they're gone. And I can see in the room now, which means I can go in the room now. Hello. I see a door now. I have the key to said that door. door. That door should not be there. No, it should not. All right. It is a creepy, creepy place. Oh shit. For the love of God, please. What the fuck? Oh, that's not a door. It's like I'm in some kind of like old churchy place. Somewhere I really shouldn't be. Uh, no. I don't think I will do that. Uh, nope, guess that's not the way either. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Maybe it was that way. the dude hmm. okay I know he's down here I just I don't know where the fuck I'm supposed to go hello other character I forgot name already where are you knock knock Did I, like, go the wrong direction? Or... something? Was I not supposed to go in here? D did I not need to go in here? Nah. Okay. All there is is up. I'm supposed to find a door with a dude. What the fuck? Where the fuck is this guy? Oh, 
Jesus fuck, dude. Walk right by her. Oh god. Help! I need help! They finally found me. I was feverish, dehydrated, and terrified. But alive. I don't remember much about the ride to the hospital, but I did mumble a few questions about the music box. I had heard it. The endless, grim song it played wouldn't stop hammering in my brain. Hallucination. A mirage. I needed to rest. That was all. Just rest. Fuck that shit. Well, that's episode one. Thank you everybody who watched, or has watched and left. That's perfectly fine. I will be back tomorrow for episode two.